this is Nana Awendo. The program is greetings from Pretoria, South Africa, New Jersey, USA, the city of Bern, Houston, Texas. You're from Nana Kabraji. Greetings from abroad means real business. There's no better way to connect with families and friends than to use our platform. Enjoy our special package with link up from your family, friends, and loved ones abroad. Greetings to Teshi. Yeah, Teshi. Day. Watch out for greetings from abroad season four. Coming to you on Metro TV every Sunday at 7 p.m. In collaboration with the Ministry of Foreign Affairs and Ghanaian Missions Abroad. Sponsored by ADB Money Transfer Services and Premier Health Insurance. Supported by Akreti Ghana, LAS Liberty School, African City Cuisine and our media partners. Powered by Premier Media Academy. Multimedia at your fingertips. Greetings from abroad. Still linking Ghanaians worldwide. Yeah. Yeah. Things from abroad is sponsored by ADB Money Transfer Services and Premier Health Insurance. Supported by Akreti Ghana, LAS Liberty School, African City Cuisine, and our media partners. Powered by Premier Media Academy. Multimedia at your fingertips. Greetings from abroad. Still linking Ghanaians worldwide. Yeah. Hello, this is Nana. The program is Greetings from Abroad. Today, our program starts from the Brandenburg Gate here in the middle of Berlin. We are doing a little sight and sound, and I'm here with David. David worked with the Ghana Mission, and David, welcome to Greetings. Thank you very much. Yes, okay, yes. so yes. I remember your boss saying, remember your history. So yes. what do you know about this gate? Because it seems to be famous, and there are a lot of tourists here. Yes, 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 yes. It seems to be famous. Famous. Actually, it is famous because mm -hmm. Brandenburg Gate is a symbol of European unity mm -hmm. in Berlin. Okay. That's basically all about it. Okay. And it's uh, in the center of Berlin. Okay. Yes. Okay. So um, if you say gate, that means that it opens to something. Does it really open to a Not really. particular? It's just a monument. It's just a monument symbolizing the unity of Europeans. Okay. Yes. Okay. Yes. Uh, yes. Okay. Actually, tourists come here just to see the famous Brandenburg Gate, but it's not really a gate as such. <laughs> yes. Yes. Okay. So yes. it's like the um, 1957 monument that we find at the Blaster Square, a very similar one that we have behind us in our background. And David is a explaining to us that it's a symbol of unity for the Europeans. And then when I ask him that, uh, revise your history, he says, oh, this is going to take 30 seconds. It's true, it's 30 seconds. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Wonderful. So if you come to Berlin, where and where would you want to see, or if somebody visits Berlin, where are some of the places you would love to send the person? Definitely the Brandenburg Gate, mm -hmm. the Checkpoint Charlie, okay. and the Parliament Buildings. Okay. We have Ziggy Zoyle behind us, that's a distance away, mm -hmm. and the um, uh, Holocaust Memorial, okay. which is behind us here, behind the American Embassy. We will go and check exactly. those out. Exactly, yes. So we will check those ones out. In the meantime, in between time, we are doing some sounds and sights, and also we will touch base with the Ghana Mission and see what is happening over there. We'll be back. The program is Greetings from Abroad. It's coming to you from Berlin in Germany. Stay tuned. ADB is pleased to roll out its new mobile banking app. 
Download the ADB mobile application from Google Play Store or the App Store and enjoy limitless possibilities on your smartphone. After downloading the ADB mobile app, sign up at your nearest ADB branch and change your default password, which will be sent to your email after setup. You are activated to enjoy the most convenient and smart way of banking. Experience mobile banking anywhere in any time, such as account balance and transaction inquiry, instant transfer of funds to other customers in different domestic banks, transfer to any mobile money wallet in Ghana, airtime top-up for all networks, utility payments for DSTV, GoTV, ECG, Surfline, Vodafone Broadband and Postpaid, ADB, Truly a Greek and more. Far behind us is the Parliament House, which we would visit soon, but uh, behind me is the Bradenburg Gate. This is the other side, the reverse side of it, and to me it looks interesting. I was asking David, is it just a monument or it opens to something? He says no, there's no, you know, structure behind it, it's just a monument. So. It's a road that goes straight away. I hear the fences were put there when President Obama made a speech here recently. Otherwise, it was a walkthrough, something that you can actually come all the way from the other side where you can see the horses and the, and the other monuments on top of the bridge, you know, there. But from this side, you see the back shot of it. And then we are standing at the three-quarter side. That means that... Uh, is a 3D version <laughs> of the structure. This is sight and sound of greetings from abroad. We are coming to you from Berlin City in Germany. Continue our sight and sound here. Um, what is this place called? That's the Jewish Holocaust Memorial Center. Mm. It's actually the memorial site of the murder Jewish. Mm. Yeah, and it's one of the historic um, sites in Berlin, mm. which I've tried to most every visitor who comes to Berlin. Okay, but it looks like tombs. Yeah, it's actually the graveyard for the thousands of Jewish who were murdered in Berlin. Oh, yeah. okay. So each one represents one human being or is just a, is a, just a monument? It's a monument and it is actually the site where they were buried. So as whether each monument, each tomb represents one person, something that I can't tell. Mm. But this is the site for the Holocaust. Yeah. And just at the right here is the American Embassy. Mm. And behind the camera is the Tear Garden, one of the uh, forest reserves within the center of Berlin. Mm. It's one of the biggest um, garden or forest within the center of Berlin. Mm. Yeah. Tear Garden. Yeah, Tear Garden. And does it mean that it is special and they are? special species or yeah, it's Berlin just a is, place that you can go and sit or it's a rest yes, place? Yes, more, more or less like a recreational center to a deep forest and for tourists, for recreation mm. and of course it's also closer to the zoo, behind the garden to the Berlin Zoo. Mm. Be the famous Berlin Zoo? The famous Berlin Zoo. What makes it famous? 
because of its um, the vast nature of the zoo and the animal population in the zoo. Sight and sound greetings from abroad. We'll be back. Stay tuned. I'm Solomon Edu Atiko, Head of E-Business and Car Services, ADB. Welcome to Greetings from Abroad Business News. Why spend time to commute to bank branches these days? It's a thing of the past. ADB offers you a real opportunity to link your account numbers to your mobile wallets. Irrespective of your location, just deposit your money at any mobile money vendor close to you, then push the money into your account wherever you are. It is for free and you can deposit as much as you want on each day. So sign up now, get to any ADB branch nationwide and register by linking your account to your mobile money wallet. Then you are free to bank on the go. The program continues here. We are doing our sight and sound here in Germany. Berlin City is the location. And Mr. Che just told me that um, this is actually the place that the real killing did take place, right? Yes, that is the information that I have. Historically, this is the site of the Holocaust. The murder took place here and they've preserved this place for the uh, memorial. So it's like a respect given to the people yes, that it's were a murdered? sacred place. You could see people around here. You can't even dare to stand on this because of the respect of the murdered Jewish. Okay. So it's more like a sacred site. Okay. Yeah. okay. So David, why would somebody would like to come and see here? Yeah, because of the history of Berlin. Mm -hmm. When somebody mentions Germany, they think Nazi. But the Germans came up with this idea of the memorial site in order to show people that we respect what happened here. Mm. Yes. Mm. So you can come and see that we are really not bad people. Mm. Yes. Mm. The Nazi uh, idea the, the, is the being, quote, yes, quote. exactly, it's Kuklus trying to be washed Kahn, away. Exactly. Uh, everything. Yes. Exactly. I remember, you know, anytime I have that picture in my mind, I see fire, I see spikes, yeah. I see people in masks. Exactly. That's exactly what is supposed to be washed away from your mind. Oh. Exactly. Can you wash it from my mind? I you want to attempt. Leave, I can. Yes. <laughs> so this is greetings from abroad. We are doing sight and sound in Berlin City. Here we are here at the Holocaust exhibition site where these tombs are the preservation of people who died as a result of the Holocaust. And we are hearing that this is exactly the place. It's not just the burial grounds. It's being kept for memory and honor of the people who went through that kind of horrible situation. We'll be back, we're just looking around, seeing what we can show you, Berlin sight and sound. David works with Ghana Mission, so is Mr. Che. David is from my sister country, Kenya. And of course, Mr. Che is from Ghana, and we are just doing this together. Stay tuned, we'll be back. from ladies, as town ladies, bantama ladies. Yes. number one ba No size. Berlin. 
Berlin director. But in chair, comma, my customers in Yana, my bargain, this year, or more, be sure, yeah, while we're two. Timidin chair, comma, sister, cruz, a cra, of a dear bene, woman, and a commercial boys, you know, I could see, bear fee, oh, so tough woman, you know, and a mere middle for ba, middle by ya be, yeah, new crew did a pa. But in chair, you know, my woman, my bargain. I do not cram the feeding me, I'm a Nika Preda, to my mamma bog and me genus ye. Timidin Chiam Momunina. Hello, my name is Teresia Samenya Afi Phillips, and I'm first secretary administration at the Embassy of Ghana in Berlin. And I'd like to say hello to all members of my family in Ghana, um, staff of the Ministry of Foreign Affairs and um, Regional Integration. And um, to all my friends. Greetings from abroad is sponsored by ADB Money Transfer Services and Premier Health Insurance. Supported by Akreti Ghana, LAS Liberty School, African City Cuisine and our media partners. Powered by Premier Media Academy. Multimedia at your fingertips. Greetings from abroad. Still linking Ghanaians worldwide. Yeah. Yeah. try to do this together. Um, we all are paddling the bicycle as a six-seater plus the rider which is uh, making it seven. Okay so behind us is uh, uh, the Holocaust uh, exhibition site and then opposite us is the American Embassy. Things from abroad is sponsored by ADB Money Transfer Services and Premier Health Insurance. Supported by Akreti Ghana, LAS Liberty School, African City Cuisine, and our media partners. Powered by Premier Media Academy. Multimedia at your fingertips. Greetings from abroad. Still linking Ghanaians worldwide. Yeah. Yeah. This is the Parliament House, according to my able, you know, tourist guides of the day, Mr. Che and of course David from the Ghana Mission here in Berlin, in Germany. We are doing our usual sight and sound, showing you where we are visiting and also giving you the opportunity to see Germany in its 
full bloom, yeah? Exactly. We want to say thank you to our friends at the Goethe Institute in Accra for facilitating our visit to Germany. Of course, the Ministry of Foreign Affairs, Ghana Missions Abroad, and all of you who said yes to us when we said we wanted to visit Germany. Thank you, German Embassy, for your support. Well, so tell me, what happens at Parliament House? Parliament House? The MPC tier and debate mm -hmm. on the laws of Germany. And that's it? Yeah, and the decision making comes from this building. Okay. Yes. But in Ghana, the MP sit in our Parliament House, make decisions and laws, and then it is passed, and we all abide by it. But I don't see people hanging around at our Parliament, Mr. J. Yeah, because of our inability to make culture culture tourism, they have inculcated tourism as part of their culture. Mm. And now people come here every day. The stand you see behind that is where they pay money to go inside to see where the decision makers sit every day and take informed decisions about the country. So do they allow people to go into the parliament house, for example? Exactly, of course, after screening, just to, for security purposes. Yes, and you show your ID and that's it. Actual parliament is out of bounds uh -huh. because there may be a session at the time of the visit. Uh -huh. Exactly. Okay, so people, tourists are allowed into the environment exactly. and they are able to tour all around. Exactly. So if we want to go to that round globe there, because I've seen a lot of people walking yes. through. Yes. It means you have to go through that tunnel. Glass house, exactly. Okay. Get screened. Give your okay, identity your card there. Pay some small amount of money. Walk through. But small amount is not small in Germany, <laughs> huh? <laughs> anyway. So I think this is what you should be doing in Ghana. We have a lot of um, resources and tourist sites that we need to promote mm -hmm. to mm -hmm. showcase what we have in Ghana. Okay. And I think with this example and with your able production team, we'll be able to also sell what we have to Ghanaians and to the rest of the world. Okay, so yeah. whatever we have, let's see how we can put it into income generation. Yeah, because the number of people that are coming here and, you know, the queue is a huge one. And if every day, even one person pays one euro, euro to enter this site, uh, the money they would get a day. David, what's your estimation? Yeah. The estimation generally in Berlin, they say um, Berlin gets 500,000 visitors a day. So if that is the statistics. Yes. Visitors a day. Yes. Are you that serious? Is, yes, exactly. That is, those are the statistics. It's been proven, and not only here, just the whole of Berlin. 500,000 yes. tourists a day, whether from outside Germany or within Germany. Because there are people who live in other parts of Germany who come to see Berlin and the rich culture and history it offers. Amazing. We are doing sight and sound here in Berlin City, in Germany, our location today. And I'm here ably flanked by Mr. Che, who is from Ghana at the Ghana Embassy, and David, who is from Kenya at the Ghana Embassy. My brother from another mother. Uh -huh. Stay with us. Remember, this is Greetings from Abroad. It's coming to you courtesy Premier Productions. We are sponsored by ADB Money Transfer Services. And this time around, Premier Insurance connects with you so you can do insurance to protect your families back home. So if you are abroad and you are interested in taking insurance cover for your parents, for your siblings, your family members, remember Premier Insurance is the one place you need to connect with. We'll put addresses and contacts so you can be in touch with them. Very important as we go around, we tell the Ghanaians, protect your families. Premier Insurance. Greetings from abroad. Thank you for watching. Greetings from abroad is sponsored by ATB Money Transfer Services and Premier Health Insurance. Supported by Akreti Ghana, LAS Liberty School, African City Cuisine, and our media partners. Powered by Premier Media Academy. Multimedia at your fingertips. Greetings from abroad, still linking Ghanaians worldwide. Yeah. Yeah. ADB, Dieu Kome, Kehan Shika Jemo Kenjemase, Aloma Nemli.
ke weku aluna ne memli majeska ke jemansele edi biji shika tohe ni hamo to injole of your western union moneygram career money transfer jemo shika ke jablo chike wa star samba unity link ke gmt ADB ya kwi ni mwa ikpa oka kpa anyo ya mane mili ni oba anyo ojo shika ni wole kwa ta o shika jemo ya tuenjo le mili le jemo ADB